Welcome to the channel. Thanks for tuning in. If you have not done so, please consider subscribing and give me a like. Leave some comments down below. So today I wanted to make a video about my morning. And right now I'm in a loaner vehicle. It's a Lexus UX. I actually don't know much about this vehicle, but my car is currently in the shop. It was making a squealing noise. So I figured before I go pick it up, let me give you a walk around of the UX and tell you what I have planned for the day. So I'm looking to get a car. So I got to pick up my car. We're going to, I'm going to go to some car dealerships. I'm going to bring you along and let's see if I make a deal today or not. But no matter what, I am definitely going to be bringing some cars on the video today, talking about some dealerships, talking about some deals. So it's going to be interesting. Let me do the walk around here. So, uh, Lexus, if you have a vehicle, usually if you bring it to service, they'll give you a loaner. They have a few different ones to select. But when I went there, they didn't really have anything. I didn't mind. I'm just happy they're giving me a car so I can get around while my car was in service, while they look at it. And they gave me this vehicle. Uh, so far, I've been able to fill it up with 25 uh, bucks. And it's called the UX... 2HH, so it's gas and hybrid, if you're not familiar with it. The MPGs, if you're wondering, is 43 in the city, 41 on the highway, and there's the interior. So it's actually really good on gas, drives nice. Figured I'd show everyone what I'm driving right now, and off to the dealership. On the way to the dealership, it looks like the dump truck hit the overpass there. Just got to the Lexus dealership, pulling up to the service department, get my car. Finally got my car back from Lexus, and now I'm putting pulling up at Audi. And we're going to Audi to get the car reappraised. They have a Lexus IS. 300 like mines for sale so i want to see what they'll give me i did go to carmax if you haven't watched that video and you can see how much carmax offered me but it's good to shop around because sometimes other dealerships do give you more than carmax and that's what we're looking for so let's see what audi has to offer and check out the inventory oh nice r8 right there but yeah inventory is looking pretty pretty good here at audi they definitely have a lot of cars so let's see what offer they give me. So here I am at Audi of South Orlando and you can see inventories doing good. All the spaces are pretty much full. So even the luxury car dealerships, their inventory is strong. So leave some comments down below. Why do you think the inventory is strong? It's just because things are normalizing or due to the high interest rates, what's your prediction? Which, what do you think is going to happen with the car market and the economy? Interested to see everyone's opinions. Audi S3. Look at the exhaust. What do you think of this 2010 Audi R8? Sixty-three thousand miles. It's an automatic carbon fiber chipping. There has some wear and tear. There's the engine. Would you still rock this? Leave some comments down below. What would you prefer? Finished up at Audi. Now I'm at the Ford dealership. Uh, they came in at less than CarMax. It came in at 22. CarMax offered me more. If you haven't watched that video, check it out. And now I'm back at the Ford dealership because believe it or not, the Ford dealerships offered me the most. And I'm actually interested in an F-150. So we'll see what happens here. And I'll let you know how it ends. So we end up making a deal taking home 
a 23 Ford F-150 XLT Sport Package. I will be going over this in a video. Thanks for watching. Subscribe. Leave some comments down below. And see you on the next one.